Hello, gang. We are yeah, yeah, yeah. FLX Beer Reviews. I am Dan. I am Mike. Dan, this looks like a coffee beer, ground from singularity. What are we drinking? Perfect for another episode of As the Beer Swirls. La, la, la. Uh, we're idiots. <laughs> um, <laughs> this is a beer from the Hot Butcher for the world. And uh, they're out of Chicago. Chicago. Illinois. Chicago. Chicago. Uh, this is their single grind. Uh, I know it wants to be a coffee porter. I know it wants I to be know. a coffee style. So badly. But Mike, this is an IPA. Ah. Not just an IPA. It's an oh, okay. extra, extra IPA. Oh. And uh, this is Citra and Strata and Mosaic Hopped India Pale Ale. 6.5 ABV. No can on date, but the IG says April 4th. Yes. And uh, this is Hop Butcher in collaboration with Berkeley Yeast, Abstracts Hops, and grown by Roy farms speaking of the ig yeah it also says roy farms citro mosaic and strata rip with berkeley yeast london tropics which ripped together with the group who put this whole idea in motion abstracts hops and their newly released sit and Moz quantum bright 100 percent utilization rate hop extracts that translates into not a coffee porter and then they also said that uh you know they dropped up this new potion. They dreamt it with their friends that I named. And, uh, you know, they want to produce a cutting edge extra, extra IPA to have our eyes spinning. Well, so far, you've succeeded. Uh, that looks like a light pear juice, very hazy, thin film ahead. It looks like a hot butcher. It does look like a hot butcher beer. Kind of opaque, milky, kind of yeah. yellow thing. So, yep. Yeah. That smells nice. Oh. That is vegetal. Vegetal with a, a nice citrus undertone with maybe a slight tropical mango or a kiwi thing. Uh, smells fresh and a little bit of minerality to it. Okay. I get like a plasticky band-aid again again i oh, smell that I see the can I think that's just hot butcher's mm -hmm. yeast it very well might be or are these guys crazy extra 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 yeast there's a nice uh there's a real ripe orange maybe a little bit of rind to it yeah a little lemon in there man it smells good. Okay. <laughs> sure. Let's yeah. just dive in. Let's dive in. Cheers. Where do we get this beer? Oh, this beer comes courtesy of our friend Ken. Kenny P. On the taps. Kenny P. Mm. Okay. That is pleasantly juicy. That pleasantly pine? I don't believe in any pleasant tasting notes on these cans anymore. <laughs> uh, here's the thing. Hot Butcher, their uh, low ABV hazies, mm -hmm. they really do a Oh, my gosh. Job. Absolutely. They, they set the bar. Um, there's a really nice, juicy, kind of tropical-y note to it. Um, I'm getting a ruby red thing. Yeah, yeah. I, I think there's... There's a really, I still think there's a really nice pithy bitterness kind of hanging out in the background, breaking up uh, some of the sweetness. Uh, it drinks kind of soft with a nice little bit of carbonation in there. There is a nice carbonation. Right in the back end, it just kind of fizzes up and mm -hmm. tickles a little bit. Man, it, it's very light and airy on the front of the palate. Almost like the carbonation. You ever get like the, the slushies, the slush puppies? Mm. And there's a bit of the carbonation. Like yeah. The, Man, I haven't slush puppy in forever. Which makes me think of a Kmart. Blue or red? I like blue. Yeah. Um, there's a, a really nice, it's like a cereal grain to it. Yeah. Like a Cheerio. Like a, you ever, you ever get the... Like the dried fruit in some of your cereal. Mm -hmm. It's like that mixed in with some Cheerios. Um, it's, but it's also hop oily. Like, it's a little burny, but I don't think it's, because it's fresh. <laughs> but there is like this, um, 
A little starfruit action. Okay. You are the starfruit master over here. Oh, I love good starfruit. Loves a good starfruit. Um, no, there is, because it's, it's not all citrus. It's not all tropical. Mm-hmm. There's a um, little starfruit. I think um, the biggest part about this beer... Oh, it, blueberry, it, too. It, it really just comes off as something... I feel like you could just drink this and want another and then maybe have some with, like, a nice lunch or something. Mm-hmm. It just it doesn't overdo the palate. It's not too sweet. It's not too bitter. It's kind of like that fine walk in between, you know, new school American pale ale kind of deal. I think it's very it's impactful a fine, for what it is. Like, yeah. I think it, it, it almost says, hey... If you didn't know any better, you'd think I was a bigger beer, but I'm not. There, there, and again, there's this um, that that sweet kind of juicy thing wraps up with just the the bubblegum thing. It's mm-hmm. again bubblegum. Yep, it is there. Like we've been getting bubblegum. I I've been mm. getting that band aid thing. Like it sounds off putting at times, but uh, this is a very good beer. I like it. Why do they do this? Look at this label. You can't what? read that writing. <laughs> I'm supposed to read tasting notes? Look at that. Yeah, good luck. It's like camouflage. It's like Arnold Schwarzenegger in Commando and, or Predator. Let's just say everything we said is on the can. Juicy lime. Okay, I could see that. I could see that. Maybe like the, okay, that star fruit it. kind of thing, lime. Um, bright tropical. I'll tell you what, how much are you paying for my next eye exam? Uh, candied orange. So there you go. Okay. I think we're sort of in the same yeah. ballpark. Uh, you know. Either way, I really like this. This is a very refreshing beer. I think Ridge would give this like a three in the books. Okay. <laughs> what are you giving it in the books? Serviceable, I'll give it a four. Yeah, I'm going to give books. it a four as well. Yep. No, this, is, this is a good beer. Uh, this is one I, I would keep in the fridge. Like, you could pull this out. Like you said, with a nice lunch, light dinner. You can pull us out of the uh, the fridge. Link trees. Yeah. No, it's good. Drink those down with a nice uh, salad, maybe a cob salad. Mm. Oh, some nice salty bacon would pair well with this. Thanks for the beer, Kenny. <laughs> we appreciate it. And thanks for watching. You just looked, you're just Cheers. like, I was sitting next to an idiot. <laughs> This beer's from the future.